What is up guys, my name is Brandon, I am one of the three awesome gamers, and this is a little gameplay I got the other day, I was playing, uh, playing with Matthew, the other awesome gamer, like always, and, uh, I'm using the MP7, finally got this gold, but, uh, not gold anymore, and I'll get to that in a second, but, uh, I go on a 20 kill streak, I wanna say, in this game, but, kinda blow it, but, whatever. It's cool. It's good. But anyways, I figured I'd talk about the new update that just happened. And it was a pretty big one for PlayStation. Like, monumentally huge. <laughs> and first of all, it's was, today is the release of the first two map packs, which is Liberation. The one that takes place in, I think it's Central Park. And it, that one, pretty big, you know like open great for snipers and assault rifles not so great for anything else <laughs> believe me marksman actually it's really hard to see enemies on that map but if you have marksman that's the, probably the best brick for that map so that's just a little tip for you guys and the second map that was released is piazza and piazza is like a small like close quarters uh, map with lots of staircases you know different levels it, it it's surprising to me that Piazza has better spawns than Liberation. It's like shocking to me. And drop shot. Toss that nade. Um But yeah, I was like Oh, I picked up this PP90 and I do some work with this bad boy. Or P90. Hmm. Um but yeah, those are just my opinions about the map. Piazza's great. Liberation meh. You know, it could be good at times, but um but anyways, I figured I would talk... Oh, wait. Oh, the rest of the update. I don't want to skip over the rest of the update. Believe me. So, uh, along with the maps, five new prestiges were added to the game. So, you can now get up to 15th prestige, which that's 400 extra new levels. And I actually just prestige, so I'm 11th level 22 now. This is before I prestiged, but... You know. <laughs> you know how to in Dead Man's Hand. I hate you so much. But, yeah, it's, uh, along with the patch, I think that's it, actually. I I heard that they messed up the mic quality and sound, and I can really tell, because everybody sounds super quiet in lobbies, and it's pretty messed up. But I use Skype for most of my playing time, so not really affecting me too much. So, uh, for the topic of this video, other than the little update news... I figured I would talk about uh, bullying, and uh, it's bullying week at my school. And today we just had a meeting in our in our uh, auditorium, and we had a guest speaker who uh, one one was like a I want to say a teacher at a nearby college, and the other one was a 19 year old girl who had been bullied like for most of her life, and she was just talking and. Uh, you know, just telling us about how she got bullied, when, why, where, all that stuff, and t telling us ways to prevent bullying. But I, I feel for her. I feel really bad. She said that she has anxiety still from her bullying, and she has, like, f like panic attacks and seizures over it. And I think that's awful. People, people destroyed this girl's life, not only socially, but, like, mentally and even physically, you know? So, I feel I feel really bad, you know, but I think we're pushing, like, the whole, like, you should see how many things we have to do in our school. Let's see, 20 kills. You should see how many things we have in our school that have to do with bullying. I mean, like, it's cool that we're informing everyone about it, but in the same note, we don't need a constant reminder every day about it. I think, you know, a thing, like, a month even would be good, but we have to sign, like, promise papers saying that like agreements that we won't bully people we have to go to meetings we have to listen to guest speakers we have to do pledges we have to make posters that say against bullying we have to just do all these things and i think that if we just had like a meeting like a month or two i mean i think they'd get the same message across i mean it's doing all this i think it's going a little bit to the extreme and there was actually, it was pretty ironic, like, so many, it's, like, so coincidental, because it's bullying week, in my health class, we were talking about bullying, and she didn't plan it out this way, it just kind of happened, 
and also there's a shooting in my state uh yeah was it yesterday it was either yesterday or two days ago but um a kid basically brought a gun to school and he was just bullied to the point of like boiling over that he just snapped and he shot five people he killed one and wounded what what is it four yeah <laughs> four plus one no uh but it's a it's a really serious issue i i get it but so so i'll talk about the story a little bit this kid he gets bullied he goes to the school and just shoots like the kids that he was being bullied by and they caught the kid the last time i heard he was in like custody but uh, you know <laughs> i'm not too sure about what the you know situation situation is right now but i get that it's like really important but i don't get that we have to stress it and like it i think a meeting we're a meeting a month or a meeting every two months would be good if the kids actually listened which i know half of them really don't i mean her, the chick who was talking her story really touched me and i felt really really bad like i wish there was something i could have done but obviously i wasn't old enough back then to you know stop bullying so you know it's it's a touchy subject and i'm probably gonna get a lot of hate for going basically saying like bullying isn't as important as they're making it out to be but it's really not in my opinion like we're pushing it and pushing it and pushing it like it i'm sure it's embedded in into my brain now and like with me i just use my common sense i'm i'm just not an idiot i know like hey i shouldn't be tormenting this person maybe i should stop okay well then i stop it's not like I'm like, oh, um, should I be making fun of this person for laughs? I don't know. Let's find out. It's it's common sense. I mean, yeah, a lot of kids at our school don't have common sense, but <laughs> my gosh, it sucks for people who actually do and actually listen. It, uh. but anyways, that's my little rant about bullying. It bullying sucks. I'm not promoting bullying. I'm just saying it's not like we need to make such a big deal out of it. But that's just my opinion. You guys let me know what you think. Comment below. Like this video if you like this little discussion. And rate it if you love me. And subscribe. Look forward to many videos in the future. And I will check y'all later.